In this video, we are going to see if a AC voltage is applied to series connection of all the passive elements that is resistance, capacitance and inductance, what will be the nature of current and power. So I have drawn a circuit where all the components, passive components are connected in series R, L, C to the applied voltage V which is Vm sin omega t. This will draw current I. This I is responsible for three voltage drops. One drop is across a pure resistance given by I into R. Second drop across pure inductance Vl equal to I into Xl where Xl is a inductive reactance given by 2 pi Fl. Now one more drop is there which is across pure capacitance given by Vc equal to I into Xc. Again Xc is a capacitive reactance given by 1 upon 2 pi Fc. Now in next slide I will draw the individual voltage waveforms and individual phasor diagrams. If this is a sinusoidal quantity which is starting from 0 obviously across resistance it will be same as the current which is given as I m sin omega t. So see here corresponding phasor diagram V and I are in phase. For inductor if current is a reference, voltage leads current by 90 degree. So this will be the nature of phasor diagram for a voltage and current across inductor. For capacitor, if current is a reference, voltage lacks current by 90 degree. So this will be a phasor diagram for voltage and current of pure capacitor. Now here total voltage will be addition of Vr, Vl and Vc obviously it is a, a vector addition. So here it will give rise to three cases. What will happen if Xl is greater than Xc? So the resultant circuit will be inductive circuit. So what happen in this case if Xl is greater than Xc, Vl will be greater than Vc. So that total voltage over here will be dominated by inductor and the value will be Vl minus Vc. So what I can say the nature of circuit will be inductive. Why? Because L is dominating factor over C. So whatever discussion we have done for RL circuit that holds true for this circuit only thing is that Vl we need to replace by Vl minus Vc. So that all phasor diagram will be identical to that of RL circuit. Impedance triangle will be identical to that of the inductive circuit. This is a case number 1. So second case is suppose Xc is greater than Xl. So obviously Vc will be greater than Vl. So the nature of circuit will be capacitive. So whatever discussion we have done for a phasor diagram, voltage triangle or impedance triangle, power triangle will be identical to that of capacitive circuit that is series RC circuit only thing is that over there Vc should be replaced by Vc minus Vl. So I have shown over here a phasor diagram that is identical to RC circuit voltage triangle that is also identical to RC circuit because here circuit will be capacitive in nature. Third possibility suppose Xl and Xc both are equal so that will give rise to a condition voltage drop across inductor is same as voltage drop across capacitor. So one voltage drop is leading current by 90 degree that is for inductive circuit and another voltage drop lagging current by 90 degree for a capacitive circuit. If both are equal these two will cancel each other leaving behind only Vr. So applied voltage is same as Vr and current and voltage both will be in phase giving rise to a nature of circuit as resistive having phase angle 0. So here Vc and Vl will cancel each other therefore I have not shown ultimately total voltage is nothing but a voltage across resistance which will come in phase with current supplied giving rise to phi as 0 degree. So we have seen all the three cases and all the three cases if in one case it is inductive in nature, 
another case it is capacitive and third case if it is nullifying each other effect it will be in resistive in nature so power triangle is again same as this power triangle is for xl greater than xc that means for inductive circuit so here p q and s i have shown along with angle phi for capacitive circuit this will be a power triangle p q and s in capacitive circuit the xc will be greater than xl so as far as the power triangle voltage triangle and phase diagrams are concerned series rlc circuit will have any one condition out of the three like uh, rl like rc or purely resistive circuit thank you